Good afternoon. How's everybody doing? That was whack. How's everybody doing? All right, all right, thank you. So ladies and gentlemen, we are the Grand Rapids Jazz Orchestra, uh, and we are West Michigan's premier big band. We're looking forward to performing for you this afternoon. Uh, I don't blame you guys for sitting in the shade. <laughs> That's fantastic, because you gotta make sure you, 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 you know, now, I get it naturally. Okay, I'm telling you, okay. But uh, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna perform some wonderful music for you. We're still working on sound and getting things all situated, so I'm gonna run my mouth for a few minutes. But let me tell you a little bit about the band. Um, we've been performing in this area for over 40 years. Um, if you wanna get an opportunity to come hear us again very shortly, we have a performance coming up a week from tomorrow night at the Frisian Horse Farm at 103rd and Kalamazoo out in Caledonia. Um, we perform at, uh, from 6.30 to 8.30 out there. Uh, and it's a big fundraiser for the No More Sidelines organization. Anybody familiar with that organization, No More Sidelines? Okay, good. Yeah, the No More Sidelines organization is a group that raises funds to bring kids out to that farm to ride horses, play with a lot of the different animals that are there, and many of the students who are participating in that are special needs. So any, anything that you can do to come out and be a part of that, we really appreciate it. So that, once again, is going to be next Monday um, at the horse farm out there. And then our, our, our performance, our uh, monthly performance, is at the Creston Brewery on Northeast Plainfield. And we'll be playing there on June 25th. What day? June 25th. Man, I'm a teacher and I'm just so proud of you guys. You guys remember that. That's great. <laughs> That's fantastic. So June 25th, we play from 5.30 to 7.30, $5.00 cover charge, the food is fantastic, also the drink is fantastic, so if you get a chance, come on out and check that out as well. Um, and then there, there are several other things that we, we do have coming up. One of the, one of the big things that um, we've been trying to get the word out about is the Michigan Jazz Festival, which is gonna be in Livonia, Michigan. Uh, we're playing there in, on uh, July 16th, and that's a, that's a really big deal because bands from all over the state of Michigan will be coming to take part in that, in that program. So, and I'll be talking about some of those things as we go along to get you up to snuff with what we're doing. So, I don't know, are we, are we ready? We're good? Okay, are you ready? Okay, all right. Are you ready to have a good time? All right, can I get a woo-woo? Woo-woo! All right, here we go. Ready? Sure. <laughs> Ready or not. <laughs> All right, here we go. One, two, oh, one, two, three, and... When you're dead, you're done. So let the good times roll. Let the good times roll. Whether you're young or old, let the good times roll. Don't sit there mumbling, talking trash. If you want to have a ball, you got to spend some cash. Let the good times roll. Let the good times roll. Whether you're young or old, let the good times roll. Hey!
everybody. The doctor's in town. We got a dollar and a quarter, and I'm ready to clown, but don't let nobody play me cheap. I got 50 cents more than I'm gonna keep. So let the good times roll. Let the good times roll. Whether you're young or old, let the good times roll. Thank you, thank you. Mike Lutley, ladies and gentlemen, on the alto saxophone. Yeah, Mikey. All right, we're gonna keep things moving right along. This is a really cool piece. I think you're gonna really enjoy it. It's got a, uh, several, several things that is go going on in it, and it's on our latest CD. Yes, this is a shameless plug I'm about to do. We have a CD, ladies and gentlemen. And you can go to our website, www.grjo.com. I'll repeat that, www.grjo.com. This CD is called Behind the Mask, and we call it Behind the Mask because during the pandemic several, several years ago, we did a recording all from each of our own homes. So we did the, the performance. And if you go to the website, you can actually see us in all of our different uh, environments performing. Um, that CD, ladies and gentlemen, once again, is behind the mask. So make sure that you check that. And oh, yeah, OK. And oh, we have, so we have some, guess what? We have some right here that you may be able to get, ladies and gentlemen. Wave your hand, Cindy. Cindy Nixon, ladies and gentlemen, how about a hand for her? Yeah, so if you want to get a CD, stop over and see Cindy, okay? Here we go. This is bebop.com.
Marsden on the tenor saxophone, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Steve Talaga on the piano. Matt Sumner on the trumpet. And Gary McCurry on the Barry saxophone. Yeah. Bebop.com. Okay, so, everybody having a good time? Okay, are you guys getting something to eat? Because we got to make sure that we support all these vendors out here. You know how important that is. So if you get an opportunity, stop in at one of the vendors and get you a little something to eat to carry you through the afternoon, okay? Make sure you get something to drink, okay? Uh, Non-alcoholic, okay? Keep it, keep it PG-13, okay? As much as you possibly can, all right? <laughs> okay. All right, this next piece, um, is is a is a an arrangement of a piece that we all know that was written by Paul McCartney um, when he was with the Beatles. Uh, you guys remember Blackbird singing in Dead of Night? Okay. Well, this one has sort of a, a swing. <laughs> Did I sing it pretty good? Okay. All right. Okay. So this one has sort of a Latin and a swing and a little bit of some of everything in it. So I think you're going to enjoy it. It's called. Blackbird.
Matt Sumner on the trumpet, ladies and gentlemen. How about another round of applause for him, huh? Yeah. So, I'm going to see if you were listening. So, we're going to be at the Creston Brewery on June what? Man, you guys were blah, 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 blah. June 25. Say what? Say it again. Yeah, June 25. So if you get a chance, come up and check us out at the, at the brewery. We, we, it's a $5 cover charge, and it's a wonderful, wonderful afternoon of jazz, ladies and gentlemen. So be sure to come out and check us out. Our next piece is going to feature our lead alto saxophone player, Jimmy Hayward, ladies and gentlemen. This was a piece that was written and uh, actually was composed by Gerald Albright. Many of you probably heard of Gerald Albright, a uh, jazz saxophone player. Uh, I think you're going to like it. It's called Chips and Salsa.
ladies and gentlemen, on the alto saxophone. Eddie Iker on the drums, ladies and gentlemen, give it up. While we're in, in this particular part of the program, ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to introduce the band to you. In the saxophone section from your left to right, Greg Marsden on the tenor saxophone, Mike Lutley on the alto saxophone. You just heard the one and only Jim Hayward on the alto saxophone. Craig Rebeck on tenor saxophone and Gary McCurry on the berry saxophone. In the trombone section, ladies and gentlemen, on the far end with the nice white hat on his head, ladies and gentlemen, Dr. Paul Brewer. Okay. Our lead trombone, Mr. Mark Wells. And making it a family affair, ladies and gentlemen, Papa Wells, David Wells, ladies and gentlemen, on, <laughs> on the third trombone. And on bass trombone, Paul King. In the trumpet section, ladies and gentlemen, on the far end, you heard him uh, a little earlier on Blackbird. This is Mr. Matt Sumner, ladies and gentlemen. Our lead trumpet player extraordinaire, Nate Vanderwerf. And next to him is the one and only Ted Craig. In the rhythm section, ladies and gentlemen, smoking on the piano over there, I call him the wizard, Steve Talaka, ladies and gentlemen. On the bass, Mr. Tom Lockwood. Woo. On the conga, Mr. Rob Mulligan. And on the drums, you heard him once again, is Mr. Eddie Iker. And myself, host that loves you most, Dr. James Sawyer, ladies and gentlemen. And this next piece that we're going to play is, was written and composed by Dr. Paul Brewer, Doc, wave, wave, at, okay, wave at the people again. And he wrote this in honor of our fearless leader, the one and only Bob Nixon, ladies and gentlemen. Bobby, stand up and take a bow. You may have never seen him kind of get around, but as he, write, as he wrote this tune, it describes him perfectly. This is called Bob the Bopper. Thank you. 
copy in. You ought to know that. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to ask all of you who should be old enough to know this. Ba, 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 da, ba, da. What cartoon? Rocky and Bullwinkle, that's right. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yeah, th that was a nice, that's a nice little quote that, that uh, Dr. Brewer put in there. Bob the Bopper, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, so this next piece was written in honor of our conga player, Rob Mulligan. Oh yeah, y'all give Rob a big round of applause. He's been, he's been doing this thing over there. And it's so cool when you, when you see all of the things that he does uh, in this piece and all of the different instruments that are playing throughout the piece. This is called Mulligan Samba.
Thank you. That was Mulligan Samba. So ladies and gentlemen, we've really enjoyed performing for you this afternoon. Did you enjoy the music? Thank you, thank you. We are, once again, the Grand Rapids Jazz Orchestra. We are the Grand Rapids Jazz Orchestra and we have uh, really enjoyed performing for you this afternoon. We're hoping that you get an opportunity to come and check us out on June. I love you guys so much. That's awesome, all right. Yeah, once again, at the Creston Brewery, ladies and gentlemen. We're gonna close out this performance. We're gonna change it up. We're gonna put a little funk in it. Uh, little story. I took a group to Europe one time and we were, we were at a place where they were having elections in the, in, the, in the town, in one of the small towns. And mm -hmm. there were four people running, but it turns out no one liked any of the candidates. 
So someone decided to put a chicken in the race. Guess who won? Yeah, right, the chicken won. That was amazing, I'm telling you. So ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna close out with something we call the chicken.
and gentlemen, the Grand Rapids Jazz Orchestra. Gentlemen, stand up. Take a bow. Thank you. Thank you so very much. We look forward to seeing you again. Thank you so very much for your hospitality.